Hello everyone, Assalamu alaikum and welcome to Softex. This video is based upon a Grammarly tutorial. In this video, I will teach you how can we use Grammarly and what is the purpose of Grammarly. First of all, I will tell you what is Grammarly. Grammarly is a free writing app to make our writing clear and effective. By using Grammarly, we can write effective and more convenient way. We can use Grammarly to create real-time suggestions. Grammarly provides us a real-time suggestions to improve our grammar, spellings and clarity as well as fluency, style and tone. By the use of Grammarly, we can help you write mistake-free in different uh, softwares. For example, we are writing an email or we are uh, posting uh, something on Facebook or we are using Twitter. Grammarly helps us to make mistake-free writing in a very convenient way. Grammarly tells about our mistakes. If we are writing something in a notepad or writing a document as well in Microsoft Word, it tells us our mistakes, spelling mistakes. If there are some grammar mistakes, it suggests us to improve the mistakes. So in this video, I will tell you uh, what is Grammarly, purpose of your Grammarly. So first of all, I have teach you what is Grammarly. I think all of you knows what is Grammarly and what is the purpose of Grammarly. So in this video, I will tell you that how can we use Grammarly in three different softwares. First of all, I will tell you that how can we use Grammarly in Google Chrome and then I will tell you how can we use Grammarly in Microsoft Word and in third and the last in LaTeX. How can we use Grammarly in LaTeX to documents to improve our English. So let's start. First of all, we go to the Google and we will write here Grammarly. We will open this link and uh, we will uh, click on this link. This link will be added in the description of this video. So first of all, we have to sign in our Grammarly account. We have to make our Grammarly account and it's totally free. If you have already a, a Grammarly account, you can log in from here. Okay, so uh, now uh, he's asking us to uh, download our Grammarly for Windows or if you don't want to download it, you can use other ways to use Grammarly and for the other ways using Grammarly, it gives us some options and from here, uh, currently we will select here Grammarly for Chrome, click on this button. So here we will click on this button install now. And it will move us towards the extensions of Google Chrome. And from here we will click on the button add to Chrome. Add extension. So uh, here the extension has been added in our Google Chrome. Okay, so here you can see that the extension of uh, Grammarly has been added in our Google Chrome. We will move towards the second step which is on Microsoft Word and I will show you that how can we use our Grammarly app in Microsoft Word. So I am opening here Microsoft Word. And uh, here I have written some text. 
a google document is also enabling our grammarly in this text a grammarly is uh, giving us some suggestions to change these words so uh, here you can see that the words containing that red line it shows that they need to improve by using grammarly and grammarly is uh, suggesting us to change these words by clicking it simple so when i will move my cursor to this word verification it gives us the following suggestions and uh, uh, simply we will click here and it will change the word for us so uh, it is very simple uh, once you write your document once you write your text you can easily use grammarly to improve your english and writing skills by using grammarly so although we will also change this Okay, so now this uh, some sort of text is improved by using Grammarly. So uh, now we will move towards uh, our third option which is on Latex Overleaf. How can we use Grammarly in our Latex Overleaf documents? So let's go. So I have uh, opened here my uh, Overleaf account. And uh, I will open some document to show you guys how can we use uh, Grammarly in our latex overleaf so I will open this social and economic contribution document and I will show you how can we use Grammarly in our overleaf document Okay, so uh, I have opened my article here and uh, to check this article and to improve my English and writing skills. So uh, we are using Grammarly when we need to generalize and finalize our paper. When we are writing some articles and uh, research papers, we need to uh, check that our article English is uh, fully final and in improved form. If there is any a Grammarly mistake, we need to resolve it. So here you can use uh, our Grammarly software to check out the writing and grammar and mistakes in your research papers. So uh, what is the matter to use that? We just need to copy here. For example, I have to check uh, the grammar and spelling mistakes in this abstract portion. So I will just uh, copy it. Copy the abstract and uh, we will move towards the Google and uh, just copy paste the abstract here. And now uh, within few moments, the Grammarly will also apply on this text and here you can see that it is only uh, highlighting the network word so we will remove this from Grammarly and rest of the abstract is all clear so we will just copy this abstract and now we will put it into our overleaf document so uh, here you can see that the network button the network word is now if, uh, showing as networks so we compile and uh, and uh, like this you can uh, improve your writing and english and grammar skills the rest of the document now i will move towards the introduction part of this article and from here I will copy some sort of text to check the grammar and spelling mistakes if there. So I will take data till here. 
copy and paste in the Google document remove the previous text paste the new text and Grammarly is also applied on this text so by clicking on the healthcare we will and uh, Grammarly will suggest the correct word for it just click on it as well as of the wavelength we will remove it by using Grammarly after that we will check if there is any other word so uh, like this you can uh, check your research article by using Grammarly copy and paste it on the Google form and remove the grammar mistakes if there are some I hope you guys like this video thank you so much for watching this video Allah Hafiz